Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome back to Beam in G Drive. In today's episode, we're going to be checking out another Car Pal mod. This one is quite the addition uh, to the grid map, as you can see. It goes by the name of Durability Drag Racing Track, and here's the premise. So you're basically just driving in a straight line as fast as possible, but... Uh, every so often you'll see a hump and as you can see this one is 0.5 meters not too bad but it gets increasingly gnarly uh, which is really gonna test your tailbones today very simple but it sounds like a lot of fun so what do you say we check it out i don't even know how long this thing goes on for but we're gonna find out and we're gonna test uh the good old d series for our first uh, victim i guess you could say apologies to all the gavril d series stands in the comments uh <laughs> but we're probably gonna have a pretty rough go of it uh with this thing but of course it's gonna start out fairly tame uh there we go over to one meters not bad at all I don't even think we've hit the bottom of the truck yet. Okay, that time we did a little bit. That's fine. Two meters. Nicely done. Three meters. Nice. Can we do four? Yes, we can. And the truck still seems to be in pretty good shape. Okay, that one hurt a little bit. Ow. Okay, we lost the tailgate as well. Door is broken open. There goes all the glass in the vehicle. Seven meters. Ow. We're still trucking along though, pun intended. Oh, it's starting to hurt though. Not gonna lie, starting to hurt. Oh, ow, yeah, that that that's hurting quite a bit. Oh my God. Oh, we're still driving though, this tough SOB of a truck. Oh my God. <laughs> Keep going. Wait, what, did it go from 15 to 200? Is it gonna? I think it's just going to drop us off the side. <laughs> okay. I should have seen that coming. Something tells me we're probably not going to drive away from this one, though. Oh, my God. Yeah, we're dead. 110% <laughs> dead, unfortunately. All right. Let's ramp it up a little bit. Let's go with, like, the most extreme off-road T-series that we... Not T-series. D-series that we have, which is probably going to be the pre-runner. Now, we actually do have another truck I want to try, which is probably just going to ace this thing completely. But for now, uh, let's try the good old pre-runner. I haven't driven this thing in quite a while, so... Uh, this should be good, but yeah, just an absolutely insane suspension on this thing. So I don't really think we're going to have too many problems here. I don't even know if we're going to feel any of these bumps to be, uh, completely honest with you. Uh, but here we go. We are absolutely blazing through this, this track right now. Four, five, haven't felt a thing yet. Six. Oh my goodness. We are destroying this track right now. And not destroying ourselves, which is the the important part. Okay, I think we may have felt that one a little bit. Oh, my God. We're still fine, though. This truck was quite literally made to do this. There we go. Oh, okay. That one hurt. That one hurt. Okay, long drop time. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Don't flip it over. We're okay. Just spin it around. Now, how is it going to handle the 200-meter drop? <laughs> Probably not great, uh, but, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Here we go. Let's get some slow motion in there as well. Why not? Oh, <laughs> crumpled like a freaking tin can, man. Although I will say, I think the uh, the roll cage probably helped us there. Are we walking away from this? Oh, hell no. Uh, but, you know, might be alive. I don't know. <laughs> any any doctors in, in the in the comments? All right, so here is what I'm interested to see. It should be fairly similar to the pre-runner, but the Dune Kicker. This thing is an absolute insane suspension beast. So if anything's going to absolutely destroy this track, I think it's going to be the TT1 Unlimited. Oh, yeah. Oh, I like the way this thing sounds, man. Here we go. And it's and it's fast, man. It's very, very fast. Look at us go. We are just blazing through this freaking track right now. I, I do think the the pre-runner was maybe lifted, had a little bit more suspension uh, distance travel, but I don't know. Maybe I'm looking too much into it. We are going so fast right now. Oh, no. 
Get it back on track. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> We're okay. We're okay, I think. Did we break anything? We did break something, unfortunately. Let's try that one more time. We'll go in first person this time. <laughs> because they're absolute bad mid. I know there's not a lot of people out there that do like first person, but I like first person, okay? When I'm not recording, most of the time I am in first person. I need that immersion, you know? So let's just see. Okay. Why is this one so hard to control? Why do I lose control so easily? Oh, no. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Oh, I'm going to miss it. Uh-oh. Oh, no. <laughs> so we're falling from 200 plus meters right into the pyramid. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Maybe the dune kicker is a little too fast, unfortunately. So I think, um, I think probably the pre-runner is going to be your sweet spot uh, with this particular track. So before we do an actual race, let's do one more here. What's another good off-road vehicle i like to think that maybe we should try the baja spec piccolina this just absolutely absurd one the, the extreme one is this one gonna be able to tame the suspension drag race let's find out here we go so far so good 0.5 beautiful it does feel a little squirrely though not gonna lie especially at high speeds we're all the way up to 130 something miles an hour my goodness, maybe I should slow it down just a tad. I do not want to flip this thing. I am way, uh-oh. I'm way too high off the ground right now. <laughs> oh, no. Ah, uh, you know what? I want to see it through, so I'm just going to uh, cheat. I'm going to use a good old YouTuber respawn there. Because I want to see how it handles these higher distances. That was pretty good for nine. What about 10? Oh, that, that bent something. Uh-oh. I'm surprised we haven't popped a wheel yet. Oh, that's a long way down. Oh, no. <laughs> hey, you know what? We were we were pretty much at the end anyway. Okay. Log way down, of course. But this thing actually stayed together fairly well. Bodywork went a flying. Uh, but besides that, not bad, man. Not bad. So what do you say? We take a bunch of pigeons and race them down. See which one can make it to the end. Does that sound like a good idea? Nah, not really, but let's do it anyway, man. All righty. So here we go. Let's see how this, uh, <laughs> let's see how this goes here. Oh, buddy. I feel like this is going to be just an absolute mess. Is this really your, your guys' full speed here? <laughs> Come on, fellas. You got to go. You know, there's actually a pigeon that he has spawned way over there which you're actually supposed to set to chase but i i forgore so we're just gonna have them chase me and see what happens they're doing okay so far very uh organized i will say okay first big drop here <laughs> come on fellas you gotta be quicker than that man there you go you got it i'll give you a little chance to, to catch up here oh Oh, no, no. We're okay. We're okay. Whoa. We're okay. You got it, guys. Are they all stopped now? <laughs> what are you guys doing up there? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Timber, I guess. Okay. <laughs> well, we're going to keep going. Never mind. We cannot keep going. <laughs> Here comes the stragglers. I think, I think that's the one that kills us. <laughs> I think nobody else is driving after that face first for this guy. Oh, my goodness gracious. Are we okay, guys? We are not okay. <laughs> oh, I love this mod. Car pal, man, you make the weirdest stuff ever, but it's always so uh, entertaining. If you guys would like to download this mod for yourself, I will link to Car Pal's Patreon down below. Check it out, man. He puts it ton of work into his videos great youtuber by the way if you aren't sub uh give him a shot he makes the weirdest stuff ever but you gotta love it and thank you to the channel members you guys make these videos possible every single day and even just watching the videos makes my job easier to do so i thank all of you guys and i will see you in the next one Bye bye